After the victory midweek, you were telling everyone to keep their feet on the ground, I guess. Is that the same message again tonight? Same message, same message. It's a, um, it's a, you know, a good feeling when you finish a game and you've won 4-0, but the, um, the business of professional football is about looking to the next week and we have another game next week and a, a big one. So, great, well done everyone, but on to the next. Seven wins in a row, 23 goals scored. It's certainly a good time for everybody, though. You do have to accept that. Yeah, we're loving it. But it's a different challenge and it's a different way of managing the team and managing the tone and uh, the direction from me is well done. It was, a, it was a, a tough performance today. At the crucial moments, we did what we had to do. And um, yeah, I thought we, was, we weren't perfect in the first half by any means. And they, they've got some, some good players and they could easily they could easily get their form going on, and I'm glad it wasn't against us today. But the big moment, Christy Pym makes a wonderful double save at 1-0, and then Liam McLean heads the ball off the goal line from a corner with a brilliant sort of diving header. Um, and that's why, Mr and Mrs Supporter, you, um, you bring everyone back at corners. The, the art is to keep the ball at the back of the net, and that's what Liam McLean did. So, you know, really pleased, but we've got to get on to the next and get our heads firmly focused on the challenge ahead with plenty of football left this season. And uh, David Wheeler, a, a, a historic moment for him, not only breaking the record but then getting eight goals in seven games. I guess you know everyone at the club must be so delighted for him. Delighted but it's, um, if you don't mind me saying, it's certainly not anywhere near our, uh, high up on our list of priorities. It's for supporters to enjoy. David's got to think about the win about next week. I made sure everyone before the game didn't talk about it, it was not important to me. It's a great thing for everyone to, to talk about and celebrate, but not our dressing room. Our dressing room is about winning, keeping a clean sheet. Whoever needs to score will score. David at the moment is the one scoring, so well done him, but uh, it's about winning. And heartening you go to get a, another four goals? Absolutely. It was, it, was, it was born out of a really good defensive team display again. And even at the end, you could see we didn't want to concede a goal. Um, right to the very end, everybody was, was intent on playing as a team and I have to say my big my big sort of um, uh, uh, positive from the game today was Liam McAlinden and Robbie Simpson. We, we we discussed before the game what's gonna happen, you know, we can't we can't have all our own way between now and the end of the season and lo and behold Ruben Reed falls ill during the warm up. Ollie then gets injured in the first ten minutes. And those two are just played so well. They were the engine of the train today, and they were a different combination, but they did not play well as a, as a pair. And I think we've learned something today. So I would say that they were the highlight of the performance today, Robbie Simpson and uh, Liam McIlinden. So congratulations to them. With that big game coming up against Plymouth next weekend, fans will obviously be keen to know Rubens was an illness, and Ollie looked like a bit of a calf strain. Perhaps. Ruben was sick. He was. He had. He had some sort of bug, and he. And he. He was just unable to go onto the pitch, you know, so um, I'm sure he'll be, he'll, be, he'll be well for next week and, and Ollie took a kick down the, down the on, on his car, so um, sort of precautionary to, to bring him off, so it was a great opportunity for Liam and Robbie and that's what we need, we need a squad that can just, you know, the same way Luke Crowell just stepped into Jordan Moore Taylor at the end, that's the strength if you're going to go through and be successful, that, that's the level of strength you need and we had it today again.